My mum works at a primary school. She's a school nurse there. She shits her job. Absolutely terrible. I had these awful stomach pains recently, and you know when yeah. I rang her up and I couldn't remember what drug it was. Really it. Obviously, it was ammonia. So I asked her, and she said, "Oh yeah, it's a uh, it's spelled E double N." Like, oh. I'm terrible at spelling. Went to Tesco, and obviously it's asked for bloody eyes. So there's no surprise that so many kids in the school have died of an ecstasy overdose, and they should be having eyes roof from instead. <laughs> But she's been working at that school for about 15 years now. And it's just quite odd. Like the first 12 years, she was just a teaching assistant. And suddenly, the last three, she just wants to be the school nurse. She says she got bored, but I'm just convinced she just wants to see the kids hurt. <laughs> My dad's gone a bit deaf recently. He's been a bit unlucky. Over Christmas, this was, so he's just recently got hearing aids in. But he just hasn't controlled volume levels at the moment. We went uh, for a curry on Christmas Day this year, and uh, we were just sitting down as a family, and he wanted to tell me and my brother what he used to do on Christmas Eve after they put us to bed, which was not very nice, really. He said, yeah, I've got your mum, put her under the Christmas tree, and I've done her. <laughs> there was a really young family next to us, and after about five minutes, when he eventually stopped, <laughs> the poor girl said to his mum, or her mum, Mum, what's felching? <laughs> yeah, he didn't really stop on that one. That's quite nice. But my mum just likes to take the piss out of my dad all the time. As soon as his hearing aids start to work, she just starts speaking to him and just starts going, <laughs> it takes off and stop doing that! <laughs> My uncle's a bit of a sex case. He came around the other week and said, Oh right, I'll bring you my new girlfriend. There was no human that actually arrived. We went on the internet, he said, Oh, I didn't realise he had Facebook either. No, he didn't. We got right in escorts.com. There was a 17-year-old Lithuanian girl. But it was good sort. Good sort. <laughs>